welcome back to Part Time Adventures. My name is Jesse, so we are here today to check out the construction at Disneyland. A couple of things going on that I've noticed. We're going to start here with Tarzan's Treehouse. Not a lot really to report. It's basically the same, as far as we can see at least. Yeah. So make sure you guys like and subscribe and come check out what else is going on around Disneyland with their construction. So an interesting kind of unexpected development, Splash Mountain looks like it's closed. I wasn't expecting that, I thought it was open. I don't think it's closed for the Princess and the Frog refurb though, I think this is just probably a normal winter time refer it will touch up some of the paint and stuff like that and maybe hopefully fix the lighting issues that I've been noticing every time I go on Splash Mountain where it looks like half the ride inside is in the dark but yeah we'll keep our eyes on that and see what's going on with Splash Mountain and it's worth noting that the Crystal Arcade is up under the uh, scaffolding and behind the wall right there so probably just some touch up, some paint. I wouldn't be surprised to see more of this down Main Street as the year goes on. But yeah, so we'll keep an eye on, see how it looks after they're done. Alright, we're gonna head over to DCA. Check out any construction that's going on over there. I don't know that there's a lot or any. But we'll head over there and take a look and see what's going on at DCA. So no construction yet, but they did recently announce that this is going to be converted into a magic key holder kind of lounge. They called it Club 33-esque, but I don't think it's going to be of that caliber, but the concept art does look pretty impressive. So we'll keep an eye on this and excited to see what they do with it and how it uh, matches with the concept art. So I don't even know if this is going to work, but our last stop here on the construction update tour is going to be Mickey's Toontown. So we're going to try to look at the construction of Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway at night, just to see if it looks any different. But my camera is not the greatest at picking up night footage, so we'll see how this experiment goes. But right away, right there at the top, I can see the outline of the hills. Let me see if you can see it right there. So well, that's something. There's a spotlight right there kind of blinding me. That wouldn't normally be there during the day. A lot of change from last week other than those hills right there the outline those white at the top and not an entirely different perspective at night but it's something and it's coming along so definitely excited about that Pretty soon this will all be different. Well, yeah, there's our update from Mickey Minnie's Runaway Railway. And then that'll wrap up our construction coverage for this week. This was our last stop for the day. So if you guys are watching, hopefully you like Disneyland construction as much as I do and just seeing what's new and going on around the park. 
to make sure you check back. I'll try to have one of these every week or every other week, just so we could see what's going on. Anything new, any construction projects. So make sure you guys are subscribed just so you can check back and see what else is going on.